uh, back 40, and you'll note there's lots of little, well, he tried to kink the hose, but he can't. It's impossible to kink this hose. You don't need a hose reel anymore because it's one of those lightweight, very durable, obviously kink-free hoses. And you're not gonna have to worry about any of those annoying water stoppages either because of the kinks. And that happens with the traditional garden hose like this or any of the other options that you've seen in your local DIY stores or home improvement stores. The Bionic hose, and we've got the 50, the 75, or the 100 foot version. I have this in my backyard. I have the 100 foot. It's in one far end of my corner, my yard and I bring it over to the dock to water my plants and pour, you know, and hose down my, my boat when we come home because you want to hose them down in the salt air. But in either case, my friend Lou's here. He's made his way over from the back 40. I have. Hello. <laughs> good to see you. <laughs> That's good to be here. It's the bionic Lou with it's the bionic, bionic hose. Lou. Yep. And you know what's neat about this hose? Stainless steel. That is such a huge point in this because that means that you can use this year round. You don't need to worry about corrosion. So if you live near the water like I do, salt water, yep. you don't have to worry about any of that. And what I was demonstrating a moment ago, one of my favorite things, you cannot kink you it. You cannot kink it. You I've can't kink too. it, can't crush it, can't cut it. You can't step on it. You can't run over no. it. You cannot crush it. You, it's just the best hose. I it know really it, is. It, it really is. I love I love having this hose. Yeah, this is great. Does this one, it's the pressure, like a normal garden hose comes, is it like 200? Well, no, a normal, so your house puts out about 60. 60. 60 is what your house uh, puts out, 60 PSI. Okay. The Bionic hose is rated to 600 PSI. <laughs> so it's 10 times more pressure than it needs to. The ends on this are rated to over 100 pounds of pulling force. So if this is like in, the, in your uh, wall on the spigot and you pull on the end of this, it's not gonna come flying That's off. good to know. Now, we also added these comfort handles to the side right here, these comfort grips, as you can see right there, which makes these really, really nice to work with. But let me show you a couple really cool things about these, okay? So we are talking about how rugged these are, right? Now, if I take a traditional rubber hose and I put it on top of here and I take a saw, <laughs> so, you know, when you're out there sometimes in your yard, you, there might be sharp things out there. You might run over it with something. Watch this. I'm gonna take the saw and go on the top of the rubber hose here, and I think we all know what's gonna happen. Oh, yeah. Made a nice little cut. This is ruined, right? You're going to get rid of that. Now, if I put the bionic hose in there, take that same saw, do the same thing. Notice, niente. Didn't do it a didn't thing to it. it. Didn't even scratch it. Looks just as good. And that's the nice thing about this. So you don't have to be babying this. You don't have to be delicate with this. You don't have to worry about if I step on it. Because who Nothing's is delicate with it. the hose? We're always pulling and yanking yeah. and tugging and trying to you know get to as far as we can go. Right. So 50, 75, or 100, same item number. And by the way, this is the only airing today to yeah. get this. Is it? It is that time of year. Summer is here, and I don't want you to, like, seriously, if you've got things at the far end of your yard, you can now hand water it if you'd like. Yeah, you could. Wash you totally could do that. Well, and then think about this, too. You know, for a lot of people, they've always got those shorter lengths of hose. You know, the 50 foots, the 75s, because they can't store or they can't drag around 100 right. feet of hose. Right. Look at this right here. On this scale, we've got um, a traditional 100 foot length of rubber hose, and then we've got the bionic hose in 100 feet. The rubber hose is weighing in at 15 pounds, okay? The bionic hose, eight pounds. Oh, it's almost so half. It's almost half. Yeah. So it's a seven pound difference between the two. So think about that as you're, you know, drugging that hose around your yard when it's full of water and everything, that's going to make a really big difference absolutely, for you. Absolutely, absolutely. And think about what you spend on a rubber hose that right. we know it's just got faults. It just has failed us, whether it gets over dried out in the sun over. or you left it out in the winter and it expanded in the water, caused it to crack. Yeah, happens this all the time. This is the thing I love. And this is where you don't even have to spend any extra money on those hose reels. No, to attach no not to if you don't want house. to. Well, this is a hundred feet of bionic hose inside of this bucket. And this is a standard bucket that you might use to wash your car, but we got 100 feet of hose in there because not only is it lighter, but it takes up less space than a traditional hose. So if you're somebody who has a boat, an RV, you know, maybe you live in an apartment or a condo so you don't have a garage, this is a great way to store a longer length of hose. I lived in an apartment at one point where they had a car washing station. Mm. It was like a spigot, basically, yeah. where you're allowed to go yeah. wash your car. They didn't give you a hose, though, so you had to have your own. So I had a little tiny short piece of hose. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, they, now 100 foot. Question though, because I yes. live in Florida and I haven't had to deal with this, but I've heard and read that this is freeze proof too. It is freeze proof, it is burn proof, it's all proof. And I'll show you that in just a minute. But you know what, let's go down. I want to show you how this coils up. Okay. Because this is kind of interesting. Now, remember rubber, we put it on the bottom of our shoes. Why? Because it has a lot of friction with the ground. So as you're walking, you know, you're not sliding around, okay? Now, that sounds great for shoes. It's not great for a hose. Because if you've ever had to drag a rubber hose, 
hose across the ground, that bad boy just wants to fight you the whole way, okay? So I'm gonna show you here real quick. This is right here, 100 feet of a rubber hose. And you can see it's an unsightly mess right there. And, and we've got every square inch of that thing loaded. The funny part is that we didn't try to kink this. No, that's just <laughs> what it wanted to do. So that's what it did, all right? Now, here's a piece of the bionic hose. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start real, oops, put that pot right there. I'm gonna start reeling this in. Now, this is, whoops, 100 feet. It's so light. It's 100 feet of bionic hose that I'm putting on here. And I want you to watch, first of all, notice how easy it is for me to reel this up here. I'm not working particularly hard over here. Talking the entire time. And you can see it just glides across the pavement. Now, this is going to give me a lot more room on this reel. And you're gonna see something really interesting in a second. Here comes the end of this. Look how quickly. Feet. Look how quickly I did that. Now, okay, so that's 100 feet of bionic hose. Not one kink, not nope. one misaligned right. you know, section. 100 feet of rubber hose. Now, I'm gonna put another 100 feet of bionic hose on here. Before I do though, I wanna show you something. This is what I was talking about with the friction. Look at the way the bionic hose moves on the ground Look here. At that. It just it's like a snake. It, it just is. it just glides around. So what I'm gonna do is take the snake here. I'm gonna attach this to the <laughs> other hose. And here's a question we get asked a lot. Can I attach multiple lengths of hose together with the bionic hose? Absolutely, as many as you need to, as many as you want to, in whatever lengths you want to. Now, we've got the second hundred feet on here, and I'm gonna get to reeling. And you're gonna be amazed. Now, first of all, bringing up the second hundred feet is actually lighter than doing 100 feet of the rubber hose. Really? Yes. And I look how fast what. this one's coming up. Now the watch this. The rubber hose, it's seen its day. <laughs> okay, that's 200 feet of bionic hose. Remember, stainless steel hose, 200 feet of it versus 100, 100. feet of the rubber hose. And you can see we, we put double the amount on here because it is more compact, because it is lighter. Now, to blow your mind a little bit more, this flower pot right here, actually has 100 feet of bionic hose inside of it. So you can hide it. Right. You don't have to have that unsightly hose hanging off the side of your house and fight with it and struggle because the truth is, yeah. these uh, rubber hoses, they get that angry. kink has memory. Oh yeah. And once it gets kinked, it wants to kink in that same spot every single time you reel it in. Well, remember too, a brand new hose is more forgiving than an older hose. When they get older, the rubber hoses, they, they don't want to do anything. They don't, they dry out. They dry they out, they so don't want to do anything. <laughs> Never going to happen with the bionic hose. So let's go back, we're going to do okay. some more torture. And keep, okay, sounds fun, <laughs> yeah. um, But this is an exclusive here right. at HSN. The bionic hose, it's been just the best-selling hose since it was introduced. And let's face it, the old-fashioned rubber hose yeah. Like, like I just said, it's seen its better days. They, they've been around forever. That, that's what I call your grandfather's hose. We're talking about a brand new type of hose here. And I'm going to show you something really cool because if you live here in Florida, Okay, yeah, well, either way, what do you want to oh, do? Okay. If you live here in Florida, you leave your hose out in the sun a lot. Now, you were talking about how when you take a hose out, uh, especially if you live up north, in the wintertime, they'll freeze and they'll burst, okay? Watch what I'm going to do here. I'm going to take a heat gun. Mm. Let me see, ooh, if I have enough cord. All right, I'm gonna take a heat gun. I'm gonna place it on top of here and I'm gonna turn it on. And I want you to see, it's, it's on top of both the metal hose, the bionic hose, as well as the rubber hose. And in just a couple of seconds, I think we all know what's gonna happen here. We're gonna start to see a little bit of smoke and here it comes. Oh yeah, there it goes. See it? And that rubber hose is starting to melt and it's starting to break down. And if I take that away, you're gonna see the burn marks. See yeah. the smoke coming off of there? And the truth is, I mean, not, not that we're gonna go after a hose with a torch gun, no. but if it's sitting out in the hot summer, and we right. just heard from in the in sun. Minnesota, it's already in the 90s. Yes. And if it's sitting out there for days and days and weeks and it months. It breaks it down it over time. Now, yeah. the other side of that coin is that if you live up north, and let's say you leave water in a hose, we all know with a rubber hose what's gonna happen. That water you know, yeah. turns into ice, it expands, and it breaks the hose, mm -hmm. okay, it bursts. That's not gonna happen with the bionic hose. And I want you to see something else too. This is the part right here that I literally just had that heat on, and you notice how it's like I can pick it up with my hand? See that? The bionic hose does not retain the heat. And so people always ask me, well, it's steel. If I leave it on my driveway when I'm washing my yeah, car, is it going to be right. too hot to pick up? It reflects the heat. That's it's why crazy. in Arizona they have white hoses. Do they? Yes, they do. Guy Yvonne told me that, so it must be true. I did not know that. Yes. That's interesting. Well, yeah. I know his family lived up there. Yeah. So most people, my producer is saying, are getting the 100-foot option, which is Makes sense. the smart choice. Yep. It's the most limited option at this point. We have 500 left. So you want the 100 footer, go for it now or wait for months for it to come back in stock. This is the season, obviously. And can you go to your, you know, obviously your home store and get the old fashioned rubber hoses? Of course, I think 
I don't know what they cost, but right. I just know this, that you end Too up much. replacing them anyway. Yeah. So you're gonna end up playing twice for something that you can have. And I've had mine for years. Oh, yeah. I, it, it sits out in the hot Florida sun. I've had it for years That's in my all backyard. I use now, because I've been selling Me this too. for over a year, and that's all I use is the Bionic Coast. Now, here's another interesting thing, okay? So I have, you know, concrete driveway. I've got pavers in my backyard, metal fences. I drag my hose all over the place, okay? Now, watch this. With a traditional hose, or even if you've got one of those fabric hoses, the expandable kind, I'm just going to rub that back and forth on the cinder block right here to simulate what would happen if you were dragging this around your yard. Now, if I turn that over, you're going to see that the sheen is gone from here and it's starting to break down the coating on the outside of this, which means it's going to get mildewed and it's eventually going to fail, okay? Now, if I do the same thing with the Bionicos, watch this. If I take the Bionicos, I do the same thing. On the table, there's actually concrete shavings right now because the Bionicos, oh. look at this. Wow. Cut a, it cut a groove. It see that? It, it cut a groove into the concrete. Look at the hose. Do you see any damage to the hose? There's a little concrete dust on it, but once I wipe that off, it looks spectacular. So you're going to be able to use this for years, a, dragging it mine. all around the property. Mine. So there is the 50, there's the 75, or the 100. They're all on flex pay, so you can separate that over the course of three monthly payments. One payment gets your hose delivered to your front door. And the fact is, and I have to, I want to talk through this PSI story again okay. because not only does the, does, the, does the rubber hose, the old-fashioned version, kink and break and right. you know get con, uh, bl, uh, Not this. cut and all of those things, yep. but this has so much more PSI. All right, if important. you've ever had the the great misfortune of having your washing machine hose burst, the one you wash your clothes in. If you've ever oh, had that burst, blah, blah. the plumbers, when they come to your house, what are they going to do? They're going to replace it with a steel braided hose. Why? Because it can handle so much more pressure and they won't burst. The Bionic hose is rated up to six 100 PSI, pounds per square inch of water pressure versus your house maybe might be putting out 60. So it's 10 times more strength that this can hold than it needs to. And this is this is it right here. There's actually more of a traditional hose on the inside and then it has all these metal windings around it that are actually kind of interwoven with each other. That's why it's so flexible and it's almost like the skin of a snake where all of these yeah. things are just, they're kind of wound so together. So does it really save us water as well? Yeah, it does because it's a slightly smaller diameter hose. So it's a what we call water saving hose. So you're not going to be it's not going to be spewing water that you don't so need. So it saves us water. It mm -hmm. gives us more pressure. Yep. I like that when I'm washing my car. Yeah. You know, I mean, I I love everything personally. It's just such a great hose. It's been it around. Really for, it's been around for a number of years now. And at HSN, this is an exclusive offer. And so I hope you can treat yourself. I know it's a hose, but don't get the old-fashioned hose that you're going to have to replace maybe next year and then the year after that. That's just wasting money. I like working smarter, not harder. I'm sure you would agree. I like spending as little as I can have to and get the best I can buy. And that's what you're getting here. The item is eight nine two four. I mean, I don't know how many spigots you have around your house most of us have two or three maybe even four maybe you should hook up the bionic hose to each and every one of them 50 75 foot and 100 foot option available 100 foot option couple hundred left that's it Lou, where'd you go? Well, I want you to see this right here. I've got a traditional rubber hose, and we tied some knots in it, and there's water going from the same spigot to both of these, okay? But when you look at the Bionic hose, notice there's many, many more knots in it. The water's coming out of their full force. But when you look at the traditional rubber hose, just a barely a little as tiny trickle coming out of there. So the Bionic hose is going to be that hose that you just can't kink. Now, the other thing we need to talk about real quick is this nozzle that you're getting that's included, okay? You twist this nozzle to turn it on and off. So right now it's off. If I turn it clockwise, it's going to turn it on. And you see the more I turn it, the more defined the stream comes out all the way down to that jet. And notice I don't have to hold it to get it to stay on. For a lot of people, Callie, it is a problem when they have a hose nozzle that they've got to actually grip because their hands have arthritis mm -hmm. or they have limited mobility. Or like yeah. I've broken fingers before. So after a while, my fingers start to throb a little bit. With this, I can just open this guy up and just stand there as long as I need to. Del kit for your plants if you want included? to. Do. It's included. Excellent. You get the nozzle. Nice. How about that? Fantastic. I know. It gets better by the minute out Every here second. in the hot Florida sun. And look at this. And you cannot stop that water flow. Even here, you pull. Go ahead, do it. And I'm strong. I grew up with is, Oh my God, she is. I'm very <laughs> strong. <laughs> wow. Hey, you're going to stay with us. I know yeah. you've got something at the end of the hour very to cool. really talk about strong. Yeah. The multi-cutting tool. Oh, I thought you meant me. <laughs> we have the coolest new item coming up to make it look like you've got the perfect fence around your yard. Stay with us.
Hey, did you know that you could stream both HSN and HSN2 live anytime, anyplace? With just the click of a button on your phone, tablet, computer, or smart TV, you're connected to the latest and greatest we have to offer. And with HSN2, there's always something different from what's currently airing on HSN. Just head over to hsn.com or open your HSN mobile app and start watching. Don't miss a thing with our HSN app, available on Apple and Android devices. Get $10 off your first in-app purchase with code WELCOME10. Opt in to push notifications for early access to exclusive app-only deals. Shop faster than ever with exclusive new product videos, only on the iPhone. Watch HSN Live anytime, anyplace. And the new shop and search features make finding your favorites easier than ever. Search app on hsn.com to download. If you're looking to spruce up your backyard or maybe even gain some privacy, take a look at the hedge fence. It's an expandable fence and it looks like it's already been grown. Like that beautiful leaf, that ivy kind of look. It's an artificial ivy leaf screen. It really looks realistic. Oh my gosh, to have this done in an instant. It's an instant privacy fence. It even fits over an existing fence. You can expand it in either direction to best fit your needs based on what you're working with. You can go horizontal, you can go vertical from 18 to 48 inches high and behind that beautiful <laughs> fence is beautiful Rebecca. Hi, how are you? Isn't this ingenious? You two of these two. at this price. This is so cool. I am absolutely in love with Blown this. Blown away, because it, it is the answer to so many problems, whether it's cracked stucco you want to hide, or maybe yes. it's you know, an ugly AC unit, That's right. pool equipment, anything that you want to hide and not let the late neighbor see, this is the answer, and it can be set up in minutes. It's I just love so this. great at any size. Long, tall, However you need it, it is going to be the answer to hiding, giving maybe, you that privacy. Yeah, maybe you've got an, I hate to say oh, yes. ugly chain link fence, but I mean, compared to how pretty this fence looks, yeah. Look at that. So a lot of us do do a chain link fence because it's, it's the, affordable. It's and, affordable. Or maybe it's what was there. And a lot of us keep our garbage cans outside because I don't want them in the garage smelling up my garage. But you also don't want your neighbors to see them on the side of the house or you get those ugly HOA letters. Look how simple it is. You just simply pull it across and you have a zip tie or a U-shaped um, stake and it will do all the work for you. It's that simple. Now each one of these, if we can show you in detail, this is what I'm so impressed by. So each one of these leaves are pre-treated. So it is going to stay this gorgeous, vibrant green for years and years to come. And they are woven around real willow rods. These are harvested willow rods. So no matter if it is the front or the back, it is stunning, natural, gorgeous piece that will add to any area that you are trying to either get privacy from or that you're trying to hide. In fact, you can see these leaves here. This is a natural hedge. Look at how beautiful it is. It's it looks very exactly impressive. the same. And how many, I'm sitting here kicking myself for in a minute because uh, I, I planted a bunch of things on the side of my house to try to conceal this old fence that should be replaced, but I'm not gonna replace it because I don't want to spend that much money. No. And I've literally been nursing these little baby seedlings to try to create the same <laughs> look that you just did instantly. Instantly. And the, the, what I love about it, too, is one time I grew ivy, um, and it overtook my front area. Oh. So it took years. I had to go cut the lattice, and then I planted. And just like you, I was, you know, trimming back, and watering, the high and maintenance. Mm -hmm. Then once it took off, I couldn't use my porch swing because it had in, woven <laughs> itself into all of the, the, um, the, the swing. So yeah. I couldn't use it. And ivy can actually ruin your home. It can ruin mm. the outside of your house, the facade of your house. It can get into the cracks of your windows. Yep, it can. So this is just a no maintenance, beautiful way. The only thing you have to do when it's outside, if it ever were to get dusty, you just rinse Close it off. It down. Oh, yeah, low pressure water and let the air dry. So this is going to be something that will look, think about this if you're in Minnesota, it will always look like it's always. summertime. <laughs> so this is, that's a great point because this is good 365 days of the year. So when everything else is dying, come fall you're gonna be able to have this luscious green and then you can even add to it if you want you could put beautiful flowers inside of it or maybe some sparkling lights to really give it a little like bit that. of a dramatic that's a flair. great idea watch this but look at a lot of us have this along maybe our decks because if you're if you have a deck you know it's all dead underneath nothing grows there you're looking at dirt look at how quickly we can hide that area and what you're seeing instead would you rather see that or this 
And it's simple with just a zip tie or a U-shape stick. So they're lightweight, very easy to work with. They expand from 18 to 48 inches. They go either horizontally or ver vertically. And you know what? You get two. Normally, I think there's an infomercial that you get one for this price, but we give you two and then there's free shipping on top of that. So if you wanna try these, in fact, on a FlexPay, let's see, you can get these for just a little bit, $16.65. See how they go for you. I mean, this is something, I think it's a pretty brilliant idea. I'm surprised somebody hasn't come up with this thought I yet. wish I had these for my um, first apartment. I overlook um, a, a parking garage. Guess what? Every time I was outside, I was either looking at somebody looking up at me, or I had no greenery. It was all concrete. This would be so beautiful. You just attach yeah. it to the railing, and I am seeing the beautiful willow rods on the back. Nobody can see me as I'm outside enjoying the outdoors, and all they're seeing are gorgeous That's ivy. That's a really good idea if you're in an apartment and you want privacy. You right. don't want neighbors looking and peering in. That's instant privacy. Just like that. And it looks super elegant. It's a customer pick. Now, this is a relatively new item to HSN, so it's, and it's a hot commodity. Thousands have been ordered. Your, we have a couple thousand left. And, and I really mean it when I say you're gonna spend twice this amount by getting it on the infomercial as you can get here at HSN. The item is 601823. The idea of not just beautifying your home, but concealing the things, like you said, trash cans, pool equipment, an AC unit, uh, giving yourself privacy from not that it's a creepy neighbor, but you don't need to, just, somebody looking exactly. in. Exactly. My house is 10 feet from the nearest house. If you just want even to sit outside without having to say hi, sometimes yeah, you just don't want to say don't. hi. This will give you that privacy, but yet it's still so beautiful. So what do I do when I get it home? It so comes it's like this. So it's going to come to you just like this. That simple. And then you have it fit to whatever size. You can go four feet if you want to, and otherwise you can go all the way down to eight feet long eight feet high, it's absolutely will morph to whatever size you need it to morph to. And if to. you wanna get two sets, you're gonna get four of these. You know what kind of space you wanna conceal or cover or beautify. And if you're a new shopper to HSN, welcome. This is a great first purchase. <laughs> Everybody, no matter how many times you've shopped with us, if ever before, can use FlexPay. One payment gets a product there and delivered to your front door. Literally one payment. We don't wait for the last payment. You get it delivered in a couple of days once you place your order. And you know, this is just the beginning of all the good things that we offer at HSN. We're outdoors right now and it's hot and steamy, so forgive me if we're all schwitzing out we're here. We're a little hot. But <laughs> we do every major product that brand you can think of out there. You think about all the national brands, whether it's beauty or electronics or home and garden, come to HSN. We, we so appreciate you being a part of this family of, you know, convenient shopping. It That's what is. this is all about. And <laughs> I think this is such a great item. It's brand new to me. And I know it's been well received here since we brought it recently. So take advantage. In fact, if you want to get that HSN card and become a VIP shopper today. Do it. The minute you get approved, you can take $10 off your first purchase. That could be on this. It's the hedge fence uh, on anything you'd like. That $10 savings is yours to use. However you'd see, I'd uh, like to do it. But this is again the back to this show you back. how realistic it is. Right. These are real harvested willow rods. And what's woven around them are these gorgeous leaves that are pre-treated. Just this gorgeous, vibrant green. They're going to stay that way for years and years to come. This isn't something you have to take down come fall. This is something you're going to be able to enjoy year round and have a touch of green even in the dead of winter. Isn't that nice? I love that. So it's beautiful from the front and the back. And then you have, it's just simple. You can, even if you don't have an ex existing fence, that's okay because you're also going to get wow. this stake. And you would just put it right down over that willow rod and right into the ground and you now have a fence. What a great idea. Maybe you need a fence. Putting a fence in is not inexpensive, and that's why I put off replacing mine for so many years. By covering it like this, it really, it looks so elegant, but creating a fence, a faux fence, if you if you will, it's really a neat alternative to any other option I've considered. And right. I started with the little seedlings, trying to creep them up and over my fence, and it's they taken me over water a year. and trim, yes. and then they can sometimes take over, and then you have to cut them all the way down. I know I had these beautiful plants. It's been so hot down here that they've been scorched, and I can't keep them alive. With this, I'm actually using it to hide some cracked stucco. So I have some cracked stucco, and I know I'm gonna have to paint probably in the next three years, but painting a house is very expensive. So I wanna prolong that just a few years. So I'm able to idea. hide that stucco. I actually did it lengthways, and then I put, I have a lamppost 
on the other side of it, it's a seven foot. This is eight foot. Remember, eight foot, it's a seven foot. It is stunning. And until you come up and touch it, you will not know that these are not real ivy. No, it's, I'm picky about that sort of thing. They look very realistic and they look healthy and they look like they're evenly grown and dispersed over that beautiful, that, that lattice, if you will. Right, this beautiful, these willow rods. And I love the fact, this is something that a manufacturer they can't recreate. This is something only you can find in nature. These are real willow rods. And so it's beautiful from the front and the back. And look at how much, I mean, you cannot tell the difference. Oop. It's absolutely stunning. So even if you have a hedge that you want to extend, this could go right yes. next to a hedge that you can extend as well. It doesn't matter if there's a real hedge back there or not. It can look like there's one. Right. Do you know what I mean? Exactly, and no matter what you have that you want to hide. So you can see right here, if you have a little area, a sitting area that you want to enjoy and you don't want to see your next door neighbors, perfect, use it. You it's could okay. use the zip ties for this, and it's, that's great. It's so true, so it comes with uh, the two little stakes? You get a, no, you get a whole bunch of stakes. You get a whole bunch of stakes and you get a whole bunch of zip ties and it will. there's one for each um, little increment. This is a for really good item. For each one of them as well. This is a good item and I can see you guys are loving it. I don't want you to wait on it because you know what? You can see by getting it on the infomercial. This is an hour called As Seen on TV. I know we all shop late night sometimes for all the good new ideas that are out there but when HSN gets a hold of those ideas, we get to do better prices, better values. We give you two, not one for this price. Free shipping to your door. 30 days to try it and see what you think. Put it where you think you might want it and then you know what, you're probably gonna come back to get another two pack because you wanna extend this kind of beauty. Exactly. It's instant beauty. Because you see how easy it is too. I mean, if you do have any of those dead areas under a home, maybe you just wanna kinda keep the critters out. Maybe it's an area that your dog likes to dig under. You can simply hide it and put it right here with either those stakes or the zip ties and you have instant beauty. This is what you're looking at instead of this or dirt, even worse dirt. I mean, look how pretty that is and they're so, vibrant and pr I just love how realistic they are until you touch it they even kind of look in the sun they kind of glisten in the sun I'm just visualizing <laughs> some of those old castle type you know the, the places that look like they've been around for hundreds of years and all the vines that are growing up the side of the building and watch this woman these weigh three pounds a piece. She did it by herself, you can too. No watering necessary, no needing to just like weave that plant through it. That's all been done for you, it's pre-assembled. So when you get your box, you're not gonna have one of these to work with, you're gonna have two of them. Oh wow, did you see that? It's instant, instantaneous beauty. And you know what else I love it for? If you have a pergola, I never really got the idea of pergolas. They're beautiful structures, but they give you no shade. And in those hot summer days, you want shade. These are three pounds. You could easily tie Good them idea. right to the top of your pergola and you're getting instant beauty, beautiful and shade. shade. Shade is the key, man, in the hot days of right. summer. Oh, that's a, a, did you see that? Look at you. As lo look, I look very strong, don't I? <laughs> <laughs> but it can be, even if you have a gazebo, you could wrap these around a gazebo. You can morph it to the shape that you want it to morph around, as you can see, just like that. It's you know, that in my simple. street, there's all those, you know, I, I think they're the power unit things, those big oh, the square, green? ugly, yes, like I, yes. it's hard to put anything around it because right nothing front of the grows house. because it's kind of hot, I guess, and you yeah, always need to access it. Right in the front of the yard, yeah. Right. Something like this would look great and instantly beautify that space that sounds you know, something that's industrial and ugh. And no maintenance. The only thing you have to do is if it gets dirty, you could just hose it down with low pressure water and air dry it. That's you got the all you have to, to do. Help you do that too. Exactly. What a but cool thing. In the middle of, of the winter when everything else is dead and drab, you're gonna be looking at beautiful real willow rods and greenery that nobody else in your neighborhood's gonna have. You could put some holly berries in here for the Ooh, holidays. Some twinkle lights. Some twinkle lights. Wouldn't that be beautiful if you have a little deck to put some twinkle lights here and sit? If you're having a little backyard party, you can really beautify a space. When you've got like, again, great concept such exciting uh, such an exciting thing to have brand, a brand new at HSN the hedge fence is here we've sold now about 6,000 of them we've got about two to go around so if you're interested don't wait on ordering and if you know right now you've got a little bit more than what what's the what's the max so expansion eight feet up eight to eight feet. feet and it depends on if you want it horizontally or vertically, or vertically. so you might want to just get a couple sets 
It, oh, I'm thinking because yeah. once you get started on something like this and realize what an easy you know fix this is to beautify a place in your yard, uh, you're going to want as many as you can get your hands on, and they are here. Watch one more time. One more time. Would you rather look at a trash can, a chain link fence? or beautiful green ivory. Fabulous. And it couldn't be more simple. 601823 <laughs> is the item number. Rebecca, thank you. Thank you. Fabulous new idea. 601823. From one great idea to the next. And this is a brand new launch. Never been seen before on HSN until this moment. It's the gardening joy. It's a folding seat and kneeler. And if you love working in your garden, but all that standing and sitting and kneeling can just put a strain on your back and in your knees, this is the product for you or for anybody in your world. Um, you know what? It gives you a lot of support as you go from kneeling to standing. And the thick moldable knee pad that's made out of the same materials as exercise mats and a lot of uh, really expensive comfort uh, mats, that's what you're getting here when you're kneeling on it. So I, in fact, if you want to read some great reviews on this item. You should read them. In fact, oh, I'm going to make my way over into the flower bed. How fun. <laughs> you know, I'm not 75, uh, but I am 55. And when I go into my gardens to do any weeding, I love being in my garden. Uh -huh. It's my therapy. It's what I love. But getting up has gotten harder and harder all the time. Bonneville Sherman, good to good? see. Thank you. Very comfortable. Good. Good to see you too. Thank yeah. you. I just I, I was seeing how easy that was. And that's what's special about this. If you love to garden but you're ready to give up because you can't be on your knees and you take it, you know, have you done this? You take a piece of carpet and you put it down, but you're still in the dirt and you're still low on the ground. That is not the solution. Today, Garden Joy is the solution. So I'm down low, but look, I have this cushion between me and the dirt. I'm not fully down on the dirt and it's comfortable. This is EVA foam, which is the same thing they use on anti-fatigue mats and exercise mats, so it's comfortable on my knees, and I can stay down gardening longer. I don't have to have that joy stolen from me because my back hurts and my shoulders hurt from bending over. I'm super comfortable, but watch this. So after I put in those plants, I want to trim my roses. Well, guess what? Turn it uh -huh. right the other way, and now... I can take a seat and I can trim my rose bushes, my other trees, all of those things so easily. Now I have a seat, I'm comfortable. I don't have to leave the garden because I'm aching. I feel wonderful. And also, the 16 inches of EVA foam is on both sides, whether you're doing the knees or you're sitting on your tush. It's 16 by six inches, it's comfortable, and now I can do the trimming. Now if you have an herb garden or hydroponics that are in earth beds, this is the perfect seat to be able to trim. But then when I wanna turn it over and I wanna be down weeding, and we all do that. You, there's more than one thing that you need to do out in your garden. I love the flexibility of turning it over yeah. and using it when I have to weed. And this helps me yeah. not be so tired because I'm not on the ground, I'm not getting dirty, I'm lifted up a little bit. And then when I want to get up, because you know what? Bending sometimes is not the problem. Getting, getting up back is up. the problem. Well, it's being but in that watch weird me, position. Watch the help. Yeah. I can push up with my arms and help myself get up. And if that's been your desire, like, okay, how do I get up? And I love gardening. This is your answer. Without a doubt. I mean, and just being in that mm -hmm. kind of that 90 degree angle for me, like it's, oh, it's incredible how much strain that takes. Even if I'm bending over just weeding, not even planting or tilling the soil. Right. I love being in my garden, but after I do it, I'm like, oh, okay, chiropractor, here I come. It's <laughs> yeah. just, it's one of those Which things. Which costs money, right? <laughs> now, now I got plants and I have to go to the chiropractor. <laughs> it, it just is not cool. Yeah. But the other thing I love about this, it's beyond even just gardening. Like mm -hmm. if you're putting in a new paver or you're, you know, yes. working on like, maybe you're tinkering on the, on the motorcycle or, you know, your yeah. lawnmower and doing the things that we and need your, to do in that grandpa. weird position. Putting, fixing the bike for the grandkids. You can be down on your knees. Maybe you're fixing your sprinkler heads and you're like me, you have 52 of them. What? <laughs> and you, yeah, I have 52 oh, sprinkler heads. And I do my oh, I own thought you meant irrigation. 52 grandchildren. I know how to fix my pipe and everything. So Good if you're for down you. on your, I know, I'm impressed with myself. If you're down on your knees and you have to fix all of those and you have to take them out and redo the screens, you have comfort on your knees because this is anti-fatigue foam, so it feels good on your knees. And like Kelly said, if you're gonna be laying pavers this summer, isn't it great to have this? Now, outside is wonderful, but I was reading so many reviews. You guys are using this inside, which means you might wanna get two, you might wanna keep one in the garage. People said they reorganized their entire 
basement, uh, or they're under their sink, and um, use this so that they weren't on the hard tile you know what? in the kitchen. What a great idea. They were here yeah. and they were cleaning out and reorganizing all their cleansers and everything. So that's a great thing. And one of my favorites was a, a woman said, you know what? I stopped praying on my knees because I couldn't get up. Aww. And she said, believe it or not, I use this so I can pray and then I can push and get myself up. That's and I thought, the best story Isn't that sweet? Ever. Isn't it? It touched my heart too. Oh, I love that. My grandmother told me years ago, she was the best woman on the, on the earth, and Aww. she worked so hard. She was a farm wife and she's like, don't be on your knees. Don't do anything on your knees. Always have padding on your knees. And so something like this, both positions, if you're sitting like this, which by the way, it adds extra seating options too, if you've got those holiday meals and whatnot. But if you turn it the other way and you're on your knees, you can spend so much more time comfortably because floors are pretty unforgiving. So we're talking about gardening and weeding and planting and all those fun things, but all the other tasks that put us in that awkward, kind of that low position, something like this could be really a true godsend. And I can see many of you are like, I need it because it's very popular. If you're on hold, I apologize, but use express ordering to get yours. We have 2,000 left. That's it. 605-453 is the item number. Brilliant it idea is. and a brand new launch here at HSN. Yeah. Exciting. It is because it's so handy. Now, I have, to, I have to confess, about two days before I got this product, my mom said to me, um, I have one of these garden carts, but it broke and I need a new one. I said, no problem. I'll order you one, Mom. And I did. And she said... I can't survive without it. She said it makes it bearable. She said it's a mm, lifesaver and good. she's 85. Good. So why is it a lifesaver? Look at this. This is when it's folded up. It can go in your garage. No problem. It can store in the corner anywhere. But then watch what happens. I open one turn it I open the other and it's totally secure now and it's ready for me to sit on or turn this way and kneel on. So what a brilliant idea. And you must know, see how it's, the foam is here and here, it's a double layer. So whether you're on top and it's your knees getting the comfort of the EVA foam or your tush getting the comfort of the EVA foam, you're in total comfort. Now you don't have to be deprived of gardening anymore. You don't have to cut it short because your back is hurting and your neck is hurting because you've been comfortable your whole time you've been out there. It's great for everybody, whether you're eight or 80, and you, you wanna teach the kids to garden, you bring them with you, they have one too. But I know um, many of us love gardening and this just makes it so much more comfortable, Callie. It, it, without a doubt, I need one of these. I love being in my gardens, but every time and I for some reason I can't seem to get a control on these weeds but I mean I get yeah. down there and I'm on my knees and it's great until I have to try to get up and it's like oh it just it exhausts you I get what your mom was saying. I yes. mean, and I'm 55, so I mean, it's definitely something, it's laborious. The whole experience of gardening mm -hmm. is fun, but it's work. Yeah. But when you've got support on, on these knees, and let's repeat what kind of foam so this is. So it's EVA foam. The, those anti-fatigue mats right. that people put in their kitchens so that their bodies don't get tired when they're cooking and doing exactly. dishes. Exactly. And some exercise mats are also made of this. So you can feel, mm -hmm. and you know, the more you use it, when you get it, it feels a little stiffer. And then as you use it, it actually gets softer. So you can feel it. So the more you use it the more you'll enjoy it and your knees will kind of conform and it will feel great it's just going to save your back and your time and don't forget it's not when you're down too it's when you're getting up if i am older or you know maybe you're gardening and you're pregnant you're in your last trimester there how do you get up balance is really hard <laughs> but gardening is your love your absolute love you have help watch this so when i need to get up from this position i'm not doing it alone which is very hard i can grab these sides which are sturdy this is this is steel this this is steel, powder coated steel. And I push up and I get that help I need and I'm standing. So now gardening is a double joy. Because most people do it out of joy. They Absolutely. Really, they love, you love the flowers, you love the trees, you love how it looks after it's done. But now you have a handy helper that stays with you and folds down and stores so easily. I predict it's they brilliant. sell out on this. And I want to welcome mm -hmm. the over 200 new customers joining us on this item tonight for your very first purchase. Great choice. It's one of those essentials. And by the way, glad you're with us. I hope you come back often and take care of all of your shopping needs at HSN. Bonnabelle just mentioned the double joy that gardening becomes when you've got a tool like this. I'm going to show you another double joy. If you put it in this position and you're down weeding and doing your gardening, then you want to get a little higher and 
trim the hedges or work with your rose bushes. You turn it this direction and then you can come around and be in a seated position to take care of some of the other chores. Not to mention, and I keep saying this because mm -hmm. when you've got holidays and there's the kids table and then there's the adults table right. and there's never enough chairs to go around, it's an extra seat for that time too. Great yeah. new item. I know, when you have Great. an extra guest and you go, well, we don't have another seat and you're like, oh, I could use my garden joy. Exactly. It, it is a perfect seat. So what I like too is, Callie is in the up position. That's where your roses are, right? And that's mm -hmm. where your bigger hedges are. Here you go. Thank you. Go I like this and my pruners. You could reach those so easily and sit comfortably. Your legs you don't have to be tired. Spend so much more time if you deadhead your flowers like I do. It takes so much yes. time. Yes. And you, like but that. you don't mind when you're comfortable exactly. and you're sitting on that foam that keeps you comfortable as well. Yeah. And then let's think about the other things. Like if you're going to have to do your sprinkler heads, how much easier it is to be able to be down but not be on the dirt. You're not getting up from the dirt with filthy knees. You're letting the garden joy do that. You can do this. Another review I read, which I thought was brilliant because I've had this problem, you have to fix your water heater whether it's in the garage or in the house, this gives you a padded surface so you can work on all those fittings and make it right. So anything that you're bending for, you now have this with you. I can see a lot of service people using this, keeping it in their truck, so that all day long they're up and down if they're uh, you know, fixing things, they have cushion to sit on. Now the cushion is actually 16 by six, so it's nice and wide and it absorbs that um, weight for you so that you don't have to worry or carry that or cut your joy short. And I think that's the greatest benefit because many times you get tired and you go, okay, I have to go in because I can't do this anymore. No, you're still gonna have energy because you're above ground and you're comfortable on your knees. You don't have to give up. And then you can put in all your flowers. Digging is no problem because my knees are comfortable, which means my back is comfortable as well. I can put in my flower, flowers, I can spend that time in the garden and it becomes a joy now. Absolutely. When Before I time switch, runs, I okay, have you help. switch. Yep, I'm you do switch. that. And, and we I'm go around. up and we can sit in that position yep. too before time runs out and quantities. Oh, okay. I'm sorry, I wish we had 10,000. We didn't even have 5,000. We didn't even have 3,000. So these could very well sell out in this very first hour on the air. We have Susan on the lines joining us in Florida who just picked it up. Good to hear from you, Susan. Welcome. Hi, it's so great to talk to you. You too. I'm glad you picked this up. Isn't it just such like, oh, where has this been all my life? It's a godsend. I just, I just, my husband just got home from work and he was standing in my room and I just happened to tune in and I went, oh my God. Yeah. I promised him I wouldn't order anything more for a while, but I said, oh, I have to get this. It's a $20 bill and look at how much it's going to help you. Is it a gardening that you're looking forward to using it in? No, I tell you what, I'm close to 70 years old and I really have a hard time bending down and getting up and this is going to be in my house. Phenomenal. I love it. It is such Good. a cool item. I agree with you. So the, whether you use it in the garden, indoor, outdoor, I know it's going to help you a lot. And I'm really glad you spent the 20 bucks to get it home. God, yes. And I'll tell you what, I got an old refrigerator that's kind of leaks at, at the bottom and I have to bend down. And I told my husband the last time I went to suck the water out of the bottom of the fridge, it was all I could do to get up. I told him, I said, I got to get yeah. something because it's just too hard to do. I, know. This, I can't. Can't I'm, wait to get it. I'm glad you yeah. said that because it's not just gardening. It's yeah. like you said, the water heater, fixing the yeah. refrigerator, washing the tires on your car, or getting, mm -hmm. you know, fixing the lawnmower or all the things that, yeah. there's so many awkward positions that you just can't feel comfortable, but you will with this. Thank yeah. you so much you for your will. call, oh, Susan. Thank, Thank you, you Susan. so much. I really appreciate talking to you. You too. Yeah. You too. Thank you. You know, we and do this have this is little caddy school. too. Oh yeah. You know, old school and you're and you're still sitting in the dirt you know it you're not you're not above ground if, if you're using this and it's still getting dirty you don't have to with the garden joy and yes isn't that a cute that's a nice little bag little caddy that you can attach right to the side whether it's a, like a cold beverage or some of your gardening tools this I think we only have a couple hundred I'll get you the item number for it this attaches and look, right over yeah, here just correct put it over. I like what they did it actually just goes right over yeah. it's just a lip it's not velcro or hook and loop you just slip it over oh it just sold out you guys got it before I even mentioned it. Thank you oh, so pouch. much. Okay. The, the well, pouch is smart gone. to get the pouch because mm -hmm. the garden that's joy a hand, is here. It's a handy little thing. So let me just show you one more time. We're sitting on it. You can see, but look at how thin it is. And then you open it up and you use it in either of the two convertible positions. The item awesome. number for you to order in the garden joy, 605453. <laughs> Thank you, Vonnebel. We've got one more great tool coming up right after this. Summer's here, and all of your favorite hosts are gathering to celebrate with hand-picked finds and new discoveries. Join 
in the fun with four or more flex pay on every purchase and special pricing that you won't want to miss. Kick off your summer with HSN Summer Host Pick Event. Starts Friday on HSN and HSN.com. I grew up always dreaming and wanting to create things. I see something and I see that we can make it better. One day, the light bulb just went off. Nobody has this. They're waiting for me to invent it. Next thing you know, you're on HSN and the whole world's hearing about it. It just sold out. <laughs> Very excited for oh you. HSN celebrates the dreamers, inventors, and entrepreneurs who follow their hearts, helping American dreams come true. Being here today proves anything is possible. to the next check out this new th uh, multi-cut tool it's a three in one and i'm telling you what the things you're going to watch us cut through today will kind of blow your mind i'm talking about tow rope plastic chain link fences tree limbs and battery cables drywall carpet garden hoses, vinyl blinds, PVC pipes. It's all because of this powerful cutter that converts to a utility knife, even a wire cutter. Everything. And look who's here. That's speaking Looking of cool. Looking snazzy in your safety glasses. <laughs> speaking yes. of cool. Speaking of cool. <laughs> Are yeah. you hot? I'm like, it's hot out here today. It's a tad warm. Ooh. It's a tad warm outside. Schitzing. Not as hot as Mark Grill. Uh, grill. Mark Grill. <laughs> Mark Gill. <laughs> All right, so anyway, yes. this is the multi-cut that I'm holding here in my hands. This is a three-in-one. It's gonna replace three different things and probably more that you have in your house. This is a serious tool. It's a heavy tool, it's made out of steel, has these nice comfort grips on the end. Now, right now, this one is locked, so that's why I can hold it like that. If I release the lock, you're gonna see that's gonna open up. Now, I want you to notice something. There is a steel cutting blade right here, and you get four extra blades in the handle of the unit itself, but there are four blades right there. There's a titanium wire cutter right here and then there's a cutting block built on the bottom now first thing I'm gonna do is we're gonna do a little bit of cutting with this and by the way this is gonna replace your mat knife it's gonna replace scissors it's gonna replace your wire cutter so all these things that you use very very often and keep in mind it's twenty dollars off yes For those of you who want to get it we have two thousand and how many to get what how many do you get do you get two of these you get two you get two of these <laughs> Yay! it was a quiz it was a it's pop quiz twenty dollars off and you get Two. Exactly. All right, so let me show you how this works real quickly. That's and now, crazy. the cool thing about this is the blade is offset from the handle, so it actually gives you more force more, okay. when you squeeze it. Right. It creates a fulcrum, and it gives you more force when you squeeze. So if I just do something simple like this little piece of twine right here, you can see how crazy easy it is for me to do that, right? But what if I move up to something a little more difficult? What if I want to cut, say, some electrical wire like this? Remember, we've got the wire cutters in the back there. Watch what I'm going to do. Just give that a squeeze, and it cuts right through that very, very easy. Watch how simple it is to do. Now, I've broken my hand a couple times, so for me to squeeze really hard on things can be very uncomfortable. It's not hard to do with the multi-cut because, again, it's giving me that extra force. Now, the other thing that's on here, you've seen the cutter, you've seen the wire cutters. Watch this. If I take a piece of carpeting, it's just a regular piece of carpeting, I'm going to flip it over. Now, this has a mat knife built into it. All I've got to do is take this little switch right here and slide this back. And if I put this together, you're going to see oh, what's handy. happened now. The blade is actually exposed exposed on the end. So if I lock this, watch if I take this piece of carpeting and I'm just gonna score it right down the side here, watch this. Go straight down the edge just like that. No Look how kidding. easily it went through that piece of carpeting. Very, very quick. And that's what's nice about this is you don't have to go, like, go searching through your toolbox to find something that's gonna do the job. The multi-cut is gonna do it very easily. And so you're we getting can, two. We can literally, I mean, I, I was gonna say replace all the other things, but just don't go buy them. Yeah. Because this is that, when we say multi-cutter, we're not kidding, and we're just getting started, so stay with us. Yeah. We have very few of these. I see almost a 1,000 gone already. Okay, so I've had to repair my sprinklers twice this summer, okay? And wow. uh, my gardener. Oh, so anyway, oh. no, and me, when oh. I drive through my driveway, just knock them over. And so here's the PVC pipe right here. Typically with PVC, you have to buy a special instrument that's a crimper, and you crimp, 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 and it cuts it eventually. Watch when I do this, and again, this is difficult to cut through. Watch how I can do it with the multi-cut. I'm just gonna rotate it one time, just like that. Excellent. Look how easily it cuts through there. And I'm not putting a ton of force on this. All I'm doing is just letting the tool do the work do for me. Do you think I could do because that? Because it's off. Yeah, you want to try? Go ahead. Here. All right. And you probably what you want to do is do it a little bit closer toward that end. Yeah, right there. Right good. Give it a good squeeze. There you go. And just rotate it. Done. Hello. Was that hard? 
No. No. It did it. Yeah. And, it I've, did it. I, and I've got a sore hand. And you so, have a sore hand. So yeah. the multi cut will do that for you. And I don't care what your hand strength is. Let's do something a little bit more difficult. If I want to come over here and watch this now, okay? Whoa. Nail heads, all right? So what I'm going to do now is I've got, I'm going to use the titanium coated uh, wire cutter and watch how I can cut the heads off of these nails, how quickly. And some of these are pretty good size. Look at that. Just goes right through. So if you're doing a job, a finishing job, and you've got that extra nail nice. head that's sticking out of there a little too far, so you don't want to take the chance of knocking it. And look at it. Just cuts right through We're calling it a those. wire cutter, but that's a nail. Yeah, I mean, it's cut, and it'll cut through. That just tells you that it'll yeah. cut through really, really thick wires yeah. as well. Maybe you're doing a little job Thank around you. the house and you've got some molding that you want to cut, okay? Do you feel the fan? I do feel the fan. It's, okay. it's, it's our greatest fan. Watch this. <laughs> watch this with the molding now. I'm going to take this piece of molding right here, right? And watch the way it just very easily does a precision cut on there. Notice that there's no weird jagged edges or anything. So True. if I'm doing a trim job, if I'm doing a job where I'm finishing some uh, carpentry work, this is very, very simple to do. Now, How let's thick is say. That? That's like a. No, it's very thick. Look at that. Yeah, that's a good size right uh, there. Yeah. But look at this. Very, very easy to do. My with notes the say cut. it'll cut up to a one and a quarter inch. Oh, easily. Like thick pieces. Easy. Easily. A uh, hose. Okay, now, if this were the Bionic hose still available, you, I wouldn't be able to do that. You wouldn't be able to do that with this. <laughs> yes. However, watch this, though. Watch the way the multi-cut. I mean, that's crazy how easy it is it's, to do. You saw me with the saw before when I was trying to cut through this with the saw, and I couldn't do it. But look at the way the multi-cut goes right through the rubber. And you, we look, that's a real rubber hose. You can see how thick that is. And boom. It's just like a very hot life note going through butter. And I'll tell you something, too. After doing this out here for a while and cutting these things, you'd think my hand would start to get sore. You would think. Not at all. So, and you guys get two. You get two of them. I thought it was one at $20 off. It's right. both of those. So a gift for you and a gift for whomever. Or keep two of them on hand. And a lot of new shoppers, again, on this brand new item. So yeah. thank you for your orders there. So on my boat, you know, I've got like the line yeah. to like be able to tie off the dock. I'm sure I could cut the line I was actually looking too. to see if I had any dock line down here. However, hold on. We've got line. How about this? That. Whoa. How about something That's like it. that? Yeah. Okay. So watch this. Watch how I can cut through that. Well, I'll do it again. Sorry, yeah, it, it falls out of frame when I do it, but watch. Watch. See the way we just cut right through that? Very, very easy to do. Very, very simple. Doesn't matter, and that's the nice thing about it, is you can feel it going through. I'm not putting a ton of yeah, force on this. Yeah. It's very, so very electrical easy. electrical wire. Yeah, I mean, everything that's on here, for instance, like now this right here is just regular wire that you would use, you know, uh, from like an extension cord or something. So you can see that. But then here's some of uh, the wire that your electrician would use, some heavier gauge wire. And look how easily we can cut right through that there. We did that one. Let me flip this up. Okay, look at guys, this. This is the coolest prop in the world. Seriously, it's $12.50 cents a gift. Free shipping on both of them to your door. Stock up, get a couple of these if you want. It's one of the practical gifts. I love to give practical gifts. I give gifts that I know people are going to use, and then, not that they think of me when they're going to use it, but right. that's not bad well, either. Well, you like to think they would. And now, this is stereo wire right here, and you can see if I get nice. it on the titanium wire cutter, how easy that is to do. Uh, maybe you're wrapping a package, and you've got some twine yeah. that you need to cut. Look how easy it cuts through no the twine. Problem. Way easier than scissors, too, because I've done this with scissors, and it's like two or three steps to go through there. Heavier wire down on the bottom right here. Let me see if I can do it the other way just so I don't keep dropping it. Sorry. Watch this. There we go. Perfect. Look how quickly it goes through that electrical wire right there when you line it up. And then let's just do some telephone wire right here. Very simple. Remember when and phones then, had wires? <laughs> and then, <laughs> everything's wireless these days. And then the essentials, like, you know what? Getting out there for tree, you know, trimming your bushes, your hedges, even Christmas tree limbs. Trees. Christmas tree, tree trees. Tree limbs for sure. In fact, I'm glad you mentioned that. I just happened to notice oh. that I have a well, tree look limb. look at that. Here, let me get the thicker piece right here. Okay. We just happen to have a tree limb right here. Here, watch this. So as I cut through the tree limb. Oh. Look how quickly, and that's green too. Look how fast yeah. I can cut right through that. Ooh, it smells pretty good. Look at the way we can cut right through that very, very easily. So if you've got to trim a head, you've got to trim your trees, the Christmas tree, because it won't fit into the, the pot when you're putting it up. That's a good point. Yeah. I'm just sitting here thinking, I've got two pruners. I spent 20 bucks on each one of them, and all they do is prune like my, my bushes and my hedges, and this one does a much better job. Mine are getting dull. Yeah. Because they use them all the time. That's one of the many different things you're going to be able to cut with this multi-cutting tool. Now, remember, this also has the um, mat knife in the front of it. And all I'm going to do is I'm going to open it. I'm going to drop the cutting table back, put it back together again. And now the blade is exposed. So if I want to, say, have a piece of vinyl like this that I need to score, watch the way I can just put that blade on there, pull that across like that, and we've cut that piece of vinyl. Look at that, right off. Just go across the other side here again. Very, very easy to do. And we're done. Very, very simple. Look at that. What is this? Oh, it's That's vinyl. It's linoleum. Oh, yeah. It's a linoleum tile. So you can see how it's very, very easy just to score that, go all the way through. Now, the backing on here is giving me a little bit of a problem, but you can see that I cut that right off you very bet. easily. You bet you did. Very, very simple to do. Okay, so 1,300 gone, 1,300 left.
Ooh. That's where we're at. You're getting not one, but two. $20 off free shipping. You don't even have to pay for all of it. But if you want to get multiples, now is the time to do it. Again, sorry about the Band-Aid. I'm just one of those tomboy girls. <laughs> I love being out in my yard and working and doing stuff like that. It's well, fun. But great tools make all the difference, especially sharp ones. And it makes it very, very simple to do. Now, for instance, let's say you get a package. Now, this is, um, you know, some electrical tape over here. Um, but watch what I can do. Let's say you get a package, you need to open it. Just take the knife, score that. Whoops, moving the whole table when I do it. Score that all the way down like that. And awesome. boom, you're done. I mean, how simple is yeah. that to do? You're going to find uses for this every single day. And the fact that you've got two of them is great. It really is. Because you keep is. one in your toolbox and keep one in your junk drawer. Maybe take one in the car with you if you want to. How do you think people are going to use it most, Lou? I think tree limbs is going to be a big one. I think cutting wires is going to be pretty big, too. Wow, look at that. Yeah, look at it. I mean, it's, it's really, it's, it's, you're right. It's the way it's kind of offset. The angle is done so that you don't have to put all your, you know, elbow grease into it. It doesn't take a lot of muscle power from you. No. It's the actual torque that the design gives to right, you. Right, exactly. Because because that blade is offset, it just makes it more force when you squeeze on this because it has that fulcrum because it is offset. Fulcrum. Now, here's a piece of, that's a good word. Here's that's a piece of molding. And again, that's a pretty thick piece. You can see that right there. Watch the way I can just go right through that. And again, I'm not squeezing terribly hard because by now my hand would be very, very sore. But look at the way that that is just going right through that. And it's a nice edge that it does too. It's Good not all points. scraggly. Good and it's not, points. It's not chipping it. It just goes right on through just like that. So again, if you're doing finish work, you don't necessarily have to reach for the saw. You can use them on the, you know, I'm going to tell you right now. These guys aren't going to be doing that. You're not cutting through that with a mat knife. You're not cutting through it with the little snips. And you're certainly not cutting okay. through it with a regular so pair of scissors. This is where extra blades are housed. On the end. Take yeah. a look at that. How yep. many extra blades do you get? I think you get four, four. You get four extra, and it, this piece actually comes out, and you can see the blades in there. So you just take them out if you ever dull this other blade, and then you just keep the rest in there. And there's the blade. Look at that. Again, you can use that as a carpet cutter. I love that you can use this literally like a utility knife. Yeah. This is an example from a tote from wire tow cutters ropes and battery cables, thick stuff, chain link fences, drywall, carpets. Believe me, that's just the, the beginning of the list. The list goes on and on with this. Less well, than a thousand to go around now. And you know what? And I like to do this demonstration just because it's kind of a show of force for this. But watch this. We've got the nails in this piece of wood. And again, you know, there are situations where you've got a nail head that you've got to cut off. Watch how easy it is to do yeah. with the multi cut and some of these I've already cut and they're, pre they're pretty close to the wood here but you can just see how I can get right in there look at that guy he's way down there and just cut that head down as far as I can see how simple that is to do and they're just going boom 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 one after the other after the other this one's just gonna pop right out look at that but look how simple it is to do with the multi-cut. And again, the secret to this is the fact that that blade, if I turn around this way, notice where those bolts are. It's offset. The blade is offset from the handles. So when I squeeze on this, it's actually applying more force than I am. So nice to have a tool that you know is going to be able to cut through. I mean, we're talking about up to an inch and a quarter, whether yeah. it's a rubber hose, tow rope, for a boat, that is thick. Battery cables. Battery I cables. I mean, that was a grounding wire you saw there a second. I mean, it, it'll just cut through anything. I've never had a problem cutting through any wire or any heat kind of metal like that. This, I'm PVC. telling you, twice this summer already with the PVC pipe in me. Wow, and it worked thing. like a champ. What kind of hose is that? Which one? Oh, that was like a radiator hose. Radiator hose. Yeah, that was hose. a radiator hose. The black hose was a radiator hose. That's a belt. Oh, crafters. How could I forget the crafters? My wife, Kelly, is a, a huge crafter. crafter. She would kill me if she was watching. I didn't talk about this. <laughs> if you do any crafters, Crafting, where you use de wooden dowels or anything like that oh or gosh, styrofoam. Right. Watch this, the way I can just cut right through that. And it's a very precision cut. It's an even cut. It's smooth as it goes through right there. You can see it. Look how easy it is to do. And that's because, again, it's offset. So if you're a crafter, even if you just use it for that, you're going to absolutely love this to do those really precise cuts. Drop this item, item number down and call for it right now because, I mean, two of these at this price, it would be two for $44.95 would have been a good price, but it's two for $24. 95 and free shipping to your door. A flex pay gets them all there. $12.48 and you can get as many two packs as you want if you want to set them aside as a gift uh, option come the holidays or anytime between now and then. The item is 559347. So we're at 1700 sold. With everybody we see on the lines, we've got maybe 700 left. You are welcome to us to every single one of them. Carpet 
carpet cover. Look at that. Right through the carpet, just like that. And we know we know the backing on carpeting is thick. We know that it's mm. difficult. Oh, yeah. But look at that blade. When I push back the cutting table, it exposes the edge of that blade on the end there. And then when I'm done with it, all I'm going to do is put that table back out, and it's going to hide the blade so nobody's going to get cut with it. See oh, that? that's a good... Do that again, please. Yeah, sure. Watch this. I slide the table back. Now okay. you can see the edge of the blade right yeah. there. That's what I was using to cut the carpet. Oh, okay. Then I can slide that back out. Uh-huh. And that's Just like that. And notice, now it's protected. Excellent. What a cool It's a neat, tool. neat tool. Yeah, really, I mean, really smart. None of these tasks were simple. No. Nope. For any other tool but this. What else can I cut? Oh, here's a good one. <laughs> here's a good one. Okay, window blinds. How many times have you put up oh, window right. blinds and you're trying to cut them all the same length? If you do and them individually, it's touch? never going to work. Watch this. This, oh. is, this is 10. 10 nice. at one time. And look at them, they're just flying. I'm making That's confetti right now. Phenomenal. Isn't that great? And they're all even. Look at that. That is all ten the same blinds. length. All even. 10 blinds at one time. I could probably do so more. So fun to watch a grown man become a little boy with a tool that That's just right. does it all. Thank you. <laughs> You're very welcome. My pleasure. That was fun. And you are welcome to all of them. It looks like they are going to be selling out, but they're not gone yet. So please continue ordering. It's 559-347. Thanks again to my crew for bringing the fan. That was a lifesaver. Really appreciate that. And thank you for being with us today. This has been a full hour of great items for the yard, but as seen on TV, like infomercial items that we get to do a better uh, values. Thanks, Lou. You're welcome. I will see you again back here tomorrow. Enjoy the rest of your evening. I know we've got great programming in store with the Monday night show tonight with Guy. It's the Monday Night Show with Adam Freeman. Uh, excuse me, that would be Guy Yovan. That's right.